Hello everyone, Chris Reynolds again here with Gospel Missions and Abode for Children. You know, the other day I was talking about uh, mental prayer. Now every morning I get up and generally the first thing I do, sometimes I'll check email, but most of the time, and I, I make sure I get this done, is I have my coffee with Jesus. And, you know, it's coffee and then morning prayer. I use my missile uh, for morning prayer. And there's a shortened version, there's a long version, there's a short version. But last week when I was dropping Paul off out at St. Francis de Sales Oratory in uh, St. Louis, they, they got together at 7 a.m. and they had what they called mental prayer. And I really hadn't heard of it. Um, I remember reading about it and it was in St. Francis de Sales' book on... Um, Introduction to a Devout Life. I do believe we carry it. If we don't, we're going to get it. But if you haven't read this, I would highly suggest reading it. Mental prayer is where you take 15 to 30 minutes, hopefully in front of the Blessed Sacrament. You know, sometimes I've done it and didn't even know it. Um, but it's, it's meditating on Jesus, just sitting there in silence. Not asking for anything, not praying for anything, not complaining, not moaning and groaning. Oh, woe is me. I need this or I need that or this person needs that. It's just sitting there and asking God to talk to you. And meditating on some part of his life. It might be the passion. It may be the birth of our Lord. It might be the visitation. Um, it you know, it could be anything, but meditating on the life of Christ. It's a profound thing to sit there in silence for 15 minutes and wait for God to talk to you. And that's where he meets us. He meets us in that, that silent time. You know, all the noise of the world, we could take 15 minutes a day. And just spend it in meditative prayer. But if you haven't read that book uh, from St. Francis de Sales, I would highly suggest it. It's a, it's a great read. I read it years ago. Uh, when I dropped Paul off at uh, the Institute the first time, at, well, we went and visited it in Chicago. Um, and Ken and Tallarico gave it to me to read and uh, while I was there. And I had three days. And I did. I read it. Um, but it, the meditative prayer part didn't sink in until last week when I actually joined them um, in front of the Blessed Sacrament for that morning prayer. And it, it was profound. It's deep. Are we giving that time every day? Are we making sure that we, we take that 15 minutes? My morning prayer routine takes about 5, 10 to 15 minutes. If we can't give God that, do we expect anything else? Of course, you know, praying the rosary, that's a meditative prayer, but it's not silence. You're, you're, you're meditating on the words that you're praying during that prayer time, but in silence. Try it. Let me know what, what you think. Um, you know, if you can uh, go to our website, I think we have the book in stock. If not, we can order it for you. Just let one of the ladies know. But don't forget one thing. Jesus loves you. Have a great week.